Mike's back at you. Another beer review. Spe I gotta send a special shout out to my boy Meat. He hates IPAs. A lot of people I know hate IPAs. This beer is for them. If you hate IPAs, probably because you drink sweeter, maltier kind of things, cocktails, whatever. This is for people like that. This is a Shiner Bach Holiday Cheer. It is a Dunkel, so it's like a German style kind of beer. Uh, beer Advocate gave it 82. I've had it years ago. It's been a while. I had it like 10 years ago. So, we're going to give it a shot. Sad day today. Screech from Saved by the Bell died. And it's not only because he died. You know, Debo died from Friday. Alex Trebek is gone. You know, these are guys that I, you know, when I was in junior high school, in high school, uh, I would come home and watch. So they're dropping dead, so I kind of feel old as fuck right now. So RIP to all the fallen heroes. Anyway, we'll get into this beer review. This is opposite of an IPA. Opposite. This is, the IBUs on here are like uh, 20, 25. IBUs basically... Uh, dictates the bitterness of a beer. So the IBUs on here are low. So if you hate IPAs, you should love this. Alright guys. Wow. Okay, the description says peaches, pecans, and nutmeg. Little bit of nutmeg, peaches for show, pecans. I would say roasted malt over the pecans is what I'm getting. No, 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 no. A little bit of pecans or pecans, like some people like to say. Peaches for show, malt for sure. Oh my goodness. So yeah, if you're an IPA guy, this is going to be <clears throat> one of my buddies, he loves Hopsecutioner. He wouldn't like this. I already know. So I'm keeping an open, my, open mind with this. Alright guys, I'm going to go in. Cheers. That's the name of the beer, actually. Holiday Cheer. Beer Advocate gave this an 82. I agree. That's right on the money. Beer advocates sometimes, some of their beers I feel like they're rated too low and other beers are rated too high. They got this right. This is like an 82. Not a returning beer. I wouldn't go search for this again. I caught this on a like build of six. I love to do build of six at Kroger. You get to pick like six different craft beers. Because I don't want to be the guy to buy a six-pack of anything, and I don't like it. Some people have been through that. It's It sucks. Because you start giving beers away, or worst-case scenario, throwing throwing beers away. hate to do that. This is, this is good. I can see this more like at a Christmas party. I'm about a, two months late. It's February 1st. People were reviewing this. Two months ago, so I'm a little late. But this is it's good. I if I was at like a Christmas party, I'd take another one, but I wouldn't I wouldn't follow this. I wouldn't ask the person like where did you get this and what it's good. Me being a beer connoisseur, I lived in North Carolina for six months and when I lived out there I discovered all kinds of good beer and this kind of beer would be like in the low in the low class this would be for them up there this would be like a 65 <laughs> this is not an 82 for people like that up there but here in Atlanta Stone Mountain it's okay it's straight it's all right I 
I feel like it smells better than it tastes, if that makes sense. Like, the aromas you get, the notes you get, compared to the actual, like, start to finish of the taste profile. A little underwhelming. But like I said, I agree with Beer Advocate, 82. Shiner, I've uh, tried their Shiner Bach years ago, which is pretty damn good. This is alright. This is alright. So, uh, I'll get back at y'all. Till next time. Yeah.